Edgewood, not Caddo Drive, Edgewood. Just down from where we stayed at the Gray Lake Resort State Park. As I mentioned to Tim off video, this one is, unless there's another entrance, this one is a little bit harder to get to than the one we stayed in. The road is just a little winding country road. Okay, guys. It was a fee boost. It's got one of them things you can pay there, or there might be an attendant there, but we're just driving through, so they're not gonna care one way or the other. Roads are pretty twisty coming through here. We got some hills. we saw the swim beach to this area when we went walking where we were camping across the lake it's pretty some nice woods very lush and green We could see this swim beach from our campsite area, so we were over there camping. And I did see the, the swim beach from the campsite we were at through the trees a while ago. This campsite actually has more people camped at it than where we camped at the state park. view of the lake and some greenery. The cat the campsites aren't as manicured. They're nice but that's cool. Looks like they have their pontoon boat just right out there. Y'all, if there's a dog, I'm probably going to spot it, so. Well, we're leaving the park now, going back towards Highway 7. We're going to go ahead and go back to our campsite so we can finish packing up. It's uh, 10 o'clock. We'll probably be out of here before noon or around noon. 
and we'll have time after we get home. It's an hour and a half drive to get home, and then we'll have time just to relax before the Monday work week rolls around. Boo. Talk to y'all later.